Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. Well, if your Wi-Fi is not showing on Windows 11 or Wi-Fi is not working on Windows 11 by any reason, we will try to fix that and we will follow very easy steps to fix that problem. Anyone can follow these steps as it's really very easy to follow. So please make sure you watch the whole tutorial and follow the steps one by one. So the very first step is check if your aeroplane mode the flight mode is turned on or off. So to check the flight mode, the aeroplane mode on Windows 11, press window and A as an alpha key together. So the moment you press window and A together, you will see your Wi-Fi, your Bluetooth flight mode. So if the flight mode is turned on, please turn it off. Once you do that, we will move to the next step. Now the next step will be the troubleshooter of Windows 11. So you just need to type troubleshoot and you will find troubleshoot settings. Once you click on that, you will find other troubleshooters. So Windows 11 itself has a troubleshooter just like Windows 10. However, it is really very powerful when it comes to fixing Windows update, uh, Wi-Fi issues, any kind of network problems, driver issues, this Windows 11 troubleshooter works very well. So here, once you search troubleshoot, you will find other troubleshooters. I'll click on that. And here we have this internet connection. You just need to click on run. It will start scanning the whole computer. It will start checking if there is an issue with the Wi-Fi. If there is a problem with the Wi-Fi, it will fix it for you, especially in Windows 11. You can do the same thing on Windows 10 computer as well. Once you do that, try to connect your computer by just pressing window and A and just click on this arrow icon, connect to your Wi-Fi and see if that works for you. If that doesn't, we will move to the next step. So the next step is to do a right click in the start icon and click on run. And here we need to type ncba.cpl. Once you have typed it, Click on OK. A new window will appear which says network connection and here you will have all of your adapters. So if you are connected to your Ethernet cable, it will show it here. If you are connected through Wi-Fi, it will show it right here. So you just need to do a right click on your Wi-Fi and you need to click on disable. And the moment you disable it, wait for two to five seconds, let it disable. And once it is disabled, just do a double click or you can simply do a right click and click on enable. So once you click on enable, for most of us, this will fix the problem. And here you will have your Wi-Fi icon back. And if Wi-Fi icon is missing on Windows 11, this is a very easy fix for that. Once you fix that issue, that's well and good. Let me know in the comment section. If it doesn't, we will move to the next step. And for that, we just need to do a right click in the start icon, and then we need to go to this device manager. Now, once the device manager is open, I'll just maximize it. Here you will find network adapters. So we are also, we are looking for network adapters and you will find it middle of the applications i mean a lot of drivers once you find it click on that and here we are looking for anything which says wireless so you might be using intel or amd realtek or any other wireless adapter you just need to select that and also take a note of it that which wireless adapter you have and once you have noted down do a right click click on update driver and click on search automatically for drivers if it says the best driver is already installed, do a right click, click on disable, and then do a right click and click on enable. That will also refresh the network. And if there is a Wi-Fi issue, that will be fixed. If there is an issue with the driver, if your uh, Wi-Fi adapter has a very old driver or a very latest driver, which is not compatible. So for that, you can just do a right click, click on update driver, and click on browse my computer for drivers and then select let me pick from a list of available drivers 
and here you can select one by one. So you can try with the top one, then go with the second one, click on next, see if that works for you. If that doesn't, come back here, select the next one, and in this manner, you will be able to fix the Wi Fi problem if there is an issue with the driver of wireless adapter. Once it is done, close this window. If that fix, well and good. If it doesn't, um, the next step will be by just doing a right click and click on settings. And here you will find Windows Update. And whatever the updates you have, you need to click on check for updates. And if it's asking you to download and install like that, like mine, then you can install it. Sometimes updating the windows to the latest versions, it will fix the problem and you can also do that. So these are the things which you can try and let me know in the comment section which step has worked for you. And guys, please hit the like and subscribe if this tutorial is helpful. I'll see you in the next video. Have a wonderful day.